Egg and Cheese opting for it. We got Palutena Lucina. So this is going to be the Nair off, right? Uh, yes. <laughs> Uh, very different Nairs though. Lu uh, Lucina gonna have to like set it up, uh, get the spacing correct. Palutena is much more. Just throw it out there. I'm just gonna run at you and I'm gonna put this giant circle out there. Yeah, just you, you have to respect it because it's big and it does a fair chunk of damage and knockback. But in and turn, uh, actually got whiff punished there, which is kind of rare to see. Uh, uses uh, upwards dancing blade. Oh my lord! Okay, Ooh, good that DI, was close. Good DI from deck. If he had DI'd that incorrectly, that would be instant death. <laughs> Oh, that meaty, oh. meaty up smash. So much more frame, active frames than it did before. Uh, it's going to catch you for a thousand times more consistently. Yeah. Oh, doesn't get the drag down into jab, unfortunately. Oh. Making sure he's looking good in this game thus far. Absolutely. Deck going for that shield breaker. Maybe a little bit too early in the set. Showing his hand a little bit or what he wants to get. Wants to, uh, right. Tries for the uh, read in the air. Doesn't quite get it. Explosive flame will miss. They're also missing oh. the edge guard. We're seeing a lot of uh, things that are just going to instant kill either of them right now. Uh, even though like 52, uh, I don't think they're going to kill Bacon Cheese. If you catch a double, if you catch a Kalu without that jump with that down air, Bay's definitely dead. So that okay, is fair. a little bit suspect. Yeah. Uh, Deck is doing a good job of avoiding all of these nares, but these grabs are a different story. And uh, the up throw does eventually kill Palutena, so yeah. Bacon Cheese actually up a stock now. The 52 plane has actually got a considerable lead here. We can just build up some set with this stock now. Absolutely. Lucina capable of killing very early, but needs a hard, hard read to get it. Uh, yeah. Hasn't got much in the way of uh, solid kill setups. Uh, uh, like Dancing Blade, technically, I, I guess. Yeah, it's it's not the beast it once was for yeah. Lucina. Uh, that's more Roy's domain these days, but... Okay. Oh, yeah, the old one through, one through jab. It's a weird that's jab. That's not how... Okay, sure. It, it hits like... <laughs> It Why hits not, inside you know? Palutena. It's really weird. That's horrifying. I have don't you, want to have think you seen about the that. clips where you could like get stuck inside the jab and just yes. move it across the stage? Inkling That's does that why. As well, because the gun, like such a massive hitbox. Yeah, I don't know if the gun knockback works the same, but I think because the jab knocks into Palutena, which forces you back, and therefore you just end up in this loop of getting pushed back and knocking I back into you. I'm loving bacon cheese's use of the uh, teleport capsules on the platform. Uh, stadium provides such a nice spacing for them from jump from ledge. Uh, it just gives them so much more options uh, from uh, hit ledge situations, uh, which traditionally Lucina is the thing is the pretty much the go-to character for. You're gonna get on this ledge and you're gonna stay there forever. Yeah. Right. Oh, oh the, not gonna kill guards. just yet. Not gonna kill just yet. Now it's gonna kill. Oh no! He oh. has his jump. Well, Fantastic. Saved so there death. by death. Yeah. And again, that teleport cancel is gonna just give him a whole stage. He's not dead. Lucina again still struggling to kill so much outside of the forward smash and that back air. That throw kills, so I didn't know that. Up throw doesn't kill as well as it used to, uh, but it can still kill. Yeah. It's like Palutena. Like 100% but still better than... Ooh, okay. ooh yeah. that was scary. No oh, way. that is hell of me to... That's horrifying. That was disgusting. Right, that is so awesome. Forget what we were chatting earlier. Palutena's feel pretty good. <laughs> no, I take everything back. I take everything back. Palutena top tier. Oh, use, like, nice use of that uh, up tilt, kind of low profiles, goes under a lot of hitboxes and shoves that hitbox, yeah, hitbox right out there. Uh, Bacon looking like he's wants to close this oh. out right here. That counter, uh, <laughs> counter hitbox is quite large, but unfortunately uh, the golf slash just goes straight through yeah, it. Yeah, it's single hit, you're going to pretty much disappear one place and appear somewhere else. It's going to be really hard to catch that. Oh, board. the well-spaced back air from Bacon Cheese. He's going to take the, the first game two Ooh. stocks to zero. Some potentially suspect DI, but... At that point, it was looking like he was losing more and more opportunities to really close that game, or like even get close to closing that game. So unfortunately, yeah. <laughs> Bacon Cheese taking that pretty humbly, I would yeah, say. Yeah, Halls is predicted to win this game. This is right. like... The Bacon is showing up and destroying the seeding. Who are these tournament organizers? Wow, you're just going <laughs> to do them like that? Nah, it's fine. Seeding is really hard. I can appreciate the fact that you're not going to know everyone as they come in. This is probably like Definitely. lots of players like first or second or third tournament where like you don't know how well they're going to form in tournament situations and against yeah. the players from other regions. You can't even use the previous game because you have a... Um, yeah, it's so different. Like, players like Jackster and you're like, oh, you're gonna, you got to see him stupid high because he's really, really good now. You just gotta know everyone. It's like, it's scary, wow. and not even six months in. So, all right, it's in a bit of a stronger lead from a stronger start from deck this time. Uh, yeah. Good call out on the uh, ledge cancel up by the way, because you'll see uh, deck's counter pick is FD. No yeah, there's ledge no, just no get, not getting out of that situation that way this time. Uh, just hold that rapid jab as long as you can. <laughs> <laughs> I respect it. You gotta you gotta hope sometimes. You're gonna get punished either way. You might as well try and 
gimmick your way out of it. Yeah, if like if they misplace it, you hit them with the rapid jump. Yeah, we'll take it, we'll take it. Deck is doing really well saving that jump until just after uh, Bacon Cheese commits to his edgeguard uh, opportunities. Obviously, that's like a classic Lucina thing you have to do, otherwise you just die instantly. But yeah. he's doing it especially well, I think, because Palo is oh, a very hard character to avoid. That like, counter, man, it lasts forever, I swear. <laughs> Just so. getting kicked out with Sky. Deck doing a bit better in this game, but still behind by like I'd say 50% now. And this is another Edgeguard situation, which he manages oh, to get away with Oh, that's a scary situation. Yeah. Oh, a nice tech read. Predicted the the panic option. You, know, I need to get on the stage right now. I am. I've got a buffer option. I'm. I'm yeah. Just I'm had to get on stage and hope he doesn't read it. Yeah. But got called out hard with the up smash. Yeah, Bacon G's playing this very, very nicely. Uh, but a much higher percent this time than he was when he took his first yeah, this last is Yeah, this is a closer game. I feel like the lack of ledges is hurting him in this game. I, I would like to see Deck playing a little bit more aggressively to catch those uh, aggressive hitboxes uh, under the ledge. You know, you can you got to slam that sword down. Yeah, uh, you can just, like, if you, you hit the Dolphin Slash, like, try and get the stage spike and hope yeah. for the best. Of course, closing that stock out with that back air, and we're back to a fairly neutral game now. Uh, They're gaming. Solid uh, DI to mitigate as much of that uh, pressure as possible. He's not getting many, many very many follow-ups in the way of uh, Nez because um, <laughs> it was it was a good try. Like if you if you think Lucian's just gonna try a hitbox, just throw out the F smash, it hits, yeah. it hits, so he learning, misses so oh well. Learning what you can hit with Palutena is terrifying F smash. Not a bad idea. Because uh, most F smashes are like safe or at least safe-ish on shield now. Which well, you can't. Maybe you still get hit. But you're not going to yeah, get hit with something. As long really as there's space. Yeah. Oh. Oh, the wake up jab. I see. I think that was a bit of a mistake from Deck. He got the the best tech uh, and then down tilted. Whereas um, if he potentially spaced that jab, he could have got a jab lock setup. Oh. But I got to call that hot, that counter out. It kind of. Yeah. It was like a grab into counter and then just oh you counter. I'm just going to smash him. Yeah. Like. <laughs> Yeah, it's facing off, off with the smash there. It's going to get yeah. some stage control. Isn't going to make his edge though. Nice stuff from Deck. He's really brought this back. Uh, tries to pull out a two frame, but just nowhere near. Uh, I see a little bit more patience on those edge guards. Just throws that explosive face in there again. Oh! There's your stage spike. Stage spike. Probably Not gonna live. high enough percent to actually kill, unfortunately. No. It's too far away from uh, the. Unless you catch with the base of that dolphin slash, it has significantly less knockback. Yeah. I think it's too far away from the stage as well, because if he was closer, it would be like so far down. It's true, it's true. Again, Ooh. he's going to there. He's going no, to actually gonna, hit it this that's time. That's going to kill this time. He air dodges to uh, give himself the ability to get back. Oh. I think he realized he air dodged. I think he's letting back on for free. Uh, he, he air dodged back in to like, shift his momentum. And, like, yeah, but Bacon Cheese, I don't think he realized the air no, dodge happened. No, potentially not. Because you could get way more aggressive if they burn yeah. their air dodge to get back there. So he's going to get the kill with an air at 160. 46 even All anyway, right. but he's at 130 himself. So he's got to be a bit careful here. Yeah, that back air, not going to quite do it just because of positioning. But it forces him to a massive disadvantage. Yeah, Deck is looking for this kill. He wants it right now. I can not tell how much more cautious Baker Cheese is being here. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah, there, there it is. So 0% uh, on this final stock. Starting to call out these ledge options a lot more now that he's not got the ability to yeah. just teleport out of these situations. I think he's got the reads now. He knows what he needs to pressure just to force these bad options. Oh, fair into fair. Nice stuff, nice stuff. Oh, no fall up on that. That a back air would have been so beautiful off of that. Yep. Down throw. Ah, oh, miss spaces that up air. Fast was a little too early. Oh, gets that punish. That explosive flame is a really laggy option. If you, if you don't get that, you're getting hit. Yeah, all right. Deck my deck is looking solid. Oh my god! Oh, no way in scary. hell. No way in hell. Bacon was predicting that, and as a result, no way Deck was predicting it. <laughs> oh, okay. I think I might be the up smash. He was looking for bacon yeah. cheese. So he just gets punished for it. You get both players off stage, and this is gonna get ledge. We're back on stage. That is scary. When I don't he was know where Deck thought he was gonna go. He ran out of options, but. Deck needs to be a bit faster on his punishes if he wants to get this kill. Cow comes out, and that's gonna be punished He's straight away with the up smash. Counter is such a it's such a move that you like you hit it and you're like yeah I'm the smartest goddamn player. Like, it does last forever. You can't catch people out with it, but at the same time it does have end frames. It's and if you get if you whiff your counter and they just stand there just Card staring at you, you're like man I'm a zombie. Yeah. <laughs> so now one all. We'll go back to po back to Pokemon Stadium. Uh, potentially. Oh, are you a DSR? DSR is no longer a thing. Uh, oh, I, I know it is a thing. I just don't ever sing at Bail Rig. I just spat everywhere. My apologies. Yeah. Okay. 
I don't actually remember the immediate rule sets, but we are Pokemon Stadium War. Uh, yeah, UKIE has a no DSR. Okay, that's fair. General standard. So I know some tournaments do modified or full DSR, despite yeah. UKIE's recommendation. Because yeah. DSR is nice. Yeah, D DSR has its benefits. I'm surprised you didn't oh, see fairy the Oh, fairy to fair to fair? What is this not fair to combo? You just got it. Sometimes you just want to hold in, man. You got to yeah. hold in. Ooh, good timing on that neutral get up to get around the... Uh, I would have got hit by play. that. Yeah, probably the same, to be <laughs> honest. <laughs> Jump from ledge is so tempting in this game, because jumping is so good. I, no, I, I just roll in and get hit somehow. <laughs> you you find a way. I respect get it. Get some stage again. Jack's uh, recovery's have been oh. so good. You heard the sound. It was right there, that laser. <laughs> he wanted it. Unfortunately, the get-up attack too strong. I am loving Dick's uh, aerial game right now. He is spacing so efficiently around the uh, big cheese. Oh, and pulls him out with the air with that forward smash. Yeah. He takes a stop for the first time. That yes. Takes the first stop for the first this time. Is his first stop lead. Oh, kind of alleviates his pressure a little bit. Uh, not that believing like, on that it's down Palutena throw. who has to like make something happen here. Absolutely. And when when you have the lead with Lucina, is when you can start just throwing out those forward airs in disadvantage, and it's so hard to play around. It's such a large hitbox that can send you so far away in such early percents. Right, and off stage there, but the Dolphin Slash will clip him. Bacon, Bacon looking for that down air and getting just. He's just flow right charting these recover, um, edge guard options. He needs to stop doing explosive lane first. He needs to do something else. Just we try and like, make Zek double de uh, think himself. Because right now he's just getting hard red every time. Yeah, we, we saw such big brain stuff from him at the start, but Deck has ad adjusted so well. Oh, there's a nice call out with the up smash on the jump option. It's so strong. It covers. Two options, you can't go wrong with that. Uh, Dex Antiers, Dex Ground again. I'm, lo I'm loving this Lucina, man. Oh, fantastic! Oh, if that had killed oh. him, it actually popped off. <laughs> 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 again, he, he, he teleports over the ledge, and Dex is just kind of stunned, like, oh, he actually, he actually yeah, did, he did that. Yeah, did it. Just charge an F smash. Just charge, throw out an F smash. What's going to happen? Yeah, because he was doing that early in the set, and he was uh, not getting anything off of it, but now would be the time to actually start yeah. doing that. <laughs> Auto rescue, yeah, it's technically a move. It, it builds percent. It's yeah. like it, it's the best projectile Palutena has because it runs explosive flame. And if you miss that, you're getting yeah. an F smash. Boy. At 120, you do not want to be throwing that uh, neutral. You barely want to be doing it in neutral anyway. Yeah. Oh, yeah. A little bit early on that F tilt puts him in a really scary situation, but Bacon not quite reacting. Oh, I'm, I think we're starting to see a bit of a crumble from Bacon. Oh, that was that the shield breaker. Sneaky B reverse uh, shield breaker. Not gonna, not, <laughs> not threatening to break the shield, but it's such a strong move in its own right. Yeah, way. it's just, it's just a good hit. Oh, move. It, it called shield breaker. It's just like F smash two, it and then really occasionally is. just breaks shield. F smash shields. you can charge in the air. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, he tried to scoop him. Oh, that back air is so strong, dude. Oh, man. Deck is now poised to take this set. Yeah, he's only at 8%, actually. He's such doing a okay in this start. Scary game one. He's just like, been like, all right, I know what I got to do. And he's just done it. And phenomenal display. To do it, and to do it on your the stage you lost on in game one yeah. as well. It's, play it's this efficiently. Showing good adaption. Like, one of the good signs of a good Smash player is can you adapt to what your opponent's throwing out? Because not everyone, everyone plays every character differently. It's whether you can adapt to what your opponent's doing and how quickly you can do it. Yeah, uh, Lucina especially is a character you can play really passively or really aggressively. Uh, so he's he's able to kind of adjust that game plan a lot more than um, some characters that are a lot more limited would be able to otherwise. And Bacon's getting really aggressive with these attempts to get these uh, uh, edge guards. I he think just he knows he has to try and make something happen. He's on 70% of his last stop. If he doesn't, if he doesn't find some way of securing this very soon, oh my God, Just that was such bad. Just grab throw him back off the stage. There's no way that was right. Yeah, that was really tragic. Yeah. <laughs> right. I don't think he expected. There's no pummel there. It was just a straight throw. Yeah, just toss him, man. Uh, oh, but he oh. pulls out that, that smash for S forward F from ledge. You miss space it. You get an F smash as the punish. He just smacked in the back of the head. All right, fair play to Bacon Cheese. He looked fantastic Bacon in that first game. Definitely that first. Game